Hello everyone, this is Food Poison from MGS and welcome back to another video. Today we are revisiting a game that I've actually reviewed a while back, a while, while back when I was still reviewing a lot of the early access games uh, and during the, uh, the Steam early access games and this is Zacharia Pinball. Uh, I've reviewed this before and I actually did really like how the graphics look. Um, it is fantastic. It, I love the way that they really worked on it. I've I've tried to do graphics before. I actually still do try to do graphics, like such as working with Blender and whatnot. And uh, it, I know for sure that these are very hard. Um, <laughs> I tried. I tried developing games. I still. I still try. But yeah, I do have a lot of respect for how much they try to make realistic, realistic pinball machines. But yeah, we will see more of that today because uh, they've actually asked me to check out some of the pinball machines and they have given me a couple of the pinball, pinball machines uh, for me to try out today. And uh, a lot, a little, some of these are, I don't know why I said that, but some of these are Devil Riders, the Mexico 90, or 86, uh, Space Shuttle, and Combat. But this one as a remake is a 2017 remake of the 1977. Uh, and I make it sound like I really, really know pinball by just spewing out all these uh, years and whatnot. But that's just because these are up, up here. And uh, I'm not too familiar with how pinball goes. But apparently there's a big uh, history, history of it. And there's a big arcade um, feel to it and sport to it, really. Uh, competitiveness to it, if you will. And uh, there is there are rules into all these boards. Or I say boards, but I think they, they call it machines. Now, all these machines that I am not too not too familiar with, but uh, you can always follow, and uh, we'll check them out. And I'm um, just kind of going through here again. Uh, I saw that the, there's VR support, which I don't think is supported yet. I've clicked on it before, but it has. Well, actually, I think it is supported. Uh, it has uh, brought me to a store page. Uh, I think you can purchase a VR support and you'll be able to play it. And that's something that I actually kind of brought up in during my last review. Uh, it's gl kind of glad to see that it is possible here. And uh, online multiplayer, I believe it is not... I don't know if this is possible because I have been told that they are working on it, the developers are working on it, but um, it seems like they, they have it done. So I'm not too sure if they actually do have it done. If they do, awesome, because that I... I Online, online support is very hard to make, but uh, also pinball and online is very interesting. I wonder if they're like playing side to side and stuff, stuff like that. And uh, yeah, the game itself, I do, uh, I did mention way before that it was early access. I believe it's still early access. I don't think they have an official start on it, but um, I do want to go through the story mode um, that they've also announced and. This is actually very interesting because they have goals. Uh, they have goals for each each machines that you go through, and you go to the next machine if you are able to pass it. And let's try it out. Uh, I do. <laughs> I do want to give a little bit of a disclaimer that I'm not a good pinball player. <laughs> you'll watch. You'll watch me get destroyed time to time. But oh wow, that was actually lucky. <laughs> and uh, we'll check it out. Um, so. As I said, there are goals as you go through these uh, these this story mode, and in this story mode, oh no, you'll see that in the right top there's rotate spinner five times, and I have to rotate the spinner in the middle right there five times. I believe from the first time I've played this, oh, I almost got that one. I got excited for a bit. <laughs> uh, yeah, it doesn't it doesn't work if it comes from backwards. You have to go you have to do it from forward. And let's do it! Oh wow, I actually did it. <laughs> Interesting. I'm impressed with myself. <laughs> but yeah, they've also um, one thing that actually they actually wanted me to mention is that there is uh, editor mode they are trying to develop, and I think that would be quite awesome if they have an editor mode. Oh, no. That's something that I think everyone can enjoy if you can make your own. And maybe people can rate how cool your ed or your edit is or your pinball machine is. Maybe they'll edit it through their own, uh, their own rendition of other machines. Who knows? All right. And so for this one, I just have to hit the the A B C D targets, which are all in the corner over there. I almost got that one, but yeah. Well, ah no. That's the one thing that I hate is losing a ball like that. Although I'm not too sure if it actually, ooh, there we go. It actually gives me points. I think it gives me points for uh, how fast I complete these things. 
hit the flashing spot targets. Oh shoot. <laughs> yeah, and that's another thing. Uh, if you're really good at this, then you can actually aim where you shoot. But obviously, I'm not good enough to do that. So it just, I, I kind of depend on luck <laughs> instead of timing and accuracy. Precision is not something that I have in this game. Ooh, hey, <laughs> it just goes through. Come on. All right, all right. I just have to hit one more over there. Yes. I guess that was a precision thing. I guess I guess I did it. I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. I think we can do this. I think we got this. I think I got this. What is this? Uh, past? Oh shoot. <laughs> past top ro rollovers. I guess this is another really good way to learn, like how, what the pinball, like the pinball machine lingo. If, you, if I could say, because a lot of these things I don't understand until I actually complete the goal. And once it does, then I'll understand what it is. So I think that's a really good... Oh, shoot. How did I confuse the left and the right of the flippers? <laughs> so I guess, and I guess the story mode actually does train you for pretty good precision, because you have to do you have to do what the the machine wants you to do, like the thing. I'm not too sure what the rollover is. I believe it's maybe that. Was that a rollover? No. Kind of thought that might be, but I guess not. We may be on this one forever because I have no idea what rollovers are. Ah, how about that? No? Maybe? Oh! Oh, okay! Oh, I guess this was the lights! That was the lights on the top. Hit, uh, pop bumpers 20 times. Okay, oh, those are the- those are the bumpers at the top. Those are not too bad. You pretty much hit it every time you get it up there. Hiya! Now the trick is- oh no. The trick is to try to get it right in between so that it hits all three of them or something, like, by the time it gets there. Oh, no, not like that. Like that, kind of like that. Oh no, I can't start losing balls like this. I like to keep my balls. No innuendo. Man, or planned. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. There we go. Do my job for me, as I would say. I'm a very lazy individual. I'm sure a lot of you will know that. Actually, I have no, I have no idea if you guys do know that. I'm a very la lazy individual. I think I may have covered that one uh, in a while. Uh, hit drop targets. Oh, and I believe the drop targets is the ones that kind of like pop in, right? Kind of like Dig Dugs. Oh, there was one. I see two in the middle. Oh, did it just pop out from the, the dead zone? Or the believed dead zone? Oh, no, not that one. <laughs> not this time. Won't happen every time. Come on. We can do it. We can do it. Yeah. I don't think those are the drop targets, though. I only see one. Oh, there we go. Whew. I'm getting better at this. Hit right drop targets. Right drop targets. How many are there? There's four. I think I see four. There's one. Didn't do anything. Come on, let's do it. Oh, no. Guess you really get to learn the, the physics of all these. Get really better with the accuracy as you keep playing. Ooh, look at that. And that's actually actually another thing that I want to mention is that all these machines are very different. Obviously, these are different, but all the sound they make 
is also different. All the sound effects as well as like, like even the even the flippers that I'm using, like that's very different. And I really like the how they paid attention to that. The oh no, that was close. I was gonna say this is pretty much playing by itself. I do like it when it does that, but let me do something too, you know. Oh, oh! Now they now they want me to actually do something. It's not working out. It's not working out. That's a really hard place for me to get. Oh, that was very close. That was kind of close. Oh no, that was close. I have to I have to do it from like the tip of tip of this tip of tip of the left left all right oh, no no <laughs> not that kind of tip come on fp am i starting to lose points is that what i'm seeing right now oh <gasps> i am i start to lose points when i run out of time it's not my fault that i can't get this I blame luck and my and my incapability to to make precision sh precision shots. <laughs> oh, there we go. See, it just does it by itself. It just does it by itself. Oh, I didn't even read what, what I was supposed to do in this one. Okay, I lost the ball already. Roll on supersonic lamps. Supersonic lamps. I see the supersonic, but where are the lamps? Is that the lamp? What's that even mean? See, the rules of the machines is something that I may not understand. Oh no! I feel like. Trying to see where it is, but I wouldn't know. Oh, totally messed up there. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, it shows uh, in in the arcade mode. It actually shows much more detail. But in here, we I guess we have the total stuff, distance, score, and whatnot. But yeah, let's check out. Let's check out one of my favorite boys. I actually tried all these out. And I guess the two favorite boards, or I say boards, but machines, I guess, is the space shuttle and the combat. Uh, I want to go through the space shuttle first, just because of how nostalgic it is uh, for me to go back to it. Um, let's restart, actually. I mean, uh, we have the arcade. I just wanted to mention, like, we do have some of the some of the same options that uh, that couple of the stuff had before like um, when we have the when we had the earlier review but it has the RK which is like a more it's like a hardcore hardcore casual I guess <laughs> hardcore casual that doesn't really make sense does it uh, more hardcore than casual and the simulation I believe is just uh, just kind of playing playing around and user I think is if you have if you get the membership um, you do get the user. They do have a couple memberships that have they uh, they introduced. Uh, I think it was like bronze, silver, and gold maybe. Um, but uh, it it has like different different kind of unlockables, and uh, all the options are possible through bronze. And of course, there are multiple players, like like this one. I can't I can't change it unless I have uh, unless I have some kind of membership, like three balls, five balls. I can only do three balls. Uh, but yeah, let's get this going. Uh, and I guess, huh, there's a lot more on these too, isn't there? There's a lot more options. Checkpoint, challenge, survival, and lamp hunter. Interesting. Something that I actually haven't checked before. But yeah, there's a lot of options now. <laughs> there's actually a lot to probably go through. Um, I don't think I'll ever be able to go through all of it so precisely unless I have t that much time. But I do want to, I, I did want to uh, have a pretty good amount of play, play gameplay to give it justice and I just when I when I said that I'll give it justice I just I just get destroyed <laughs> but, <laughs> but this one actually rem really reminded me of the the good old Windows Windows pinball and and I keep dying I just keep dying <laughs> I don't even know how I did that it's all it's, it's almost impressive that I can do all those things there we go. I'm not dead yet. 
See, all these sound, it really reminds me of the Windows one. It also has that all, like, maybe it's just because it has that space theme. Maybe the Windows one is based off of Space Shuttle. Who knows? I'm sure that, I'm sure the developers know, actually. <laughs> Questions for the developers, I guess. Ugh, boy. I think that was it, though. <laughs> that was it. I'm so bad at this game. Uh... That's it, global best score is way more, way more. And I like how all the balls show the summary. It shows the, it shows how much the person actually did it for each ball. All right, but let's go to my favorite board. Um, that They use something, I believe they call the dot matrix display, which is if you go to a fly cam and kind of move over there, you see that that one that thinks as uh, Magic Pixel presents? That is, I believe they what they call a, uh, that ma that matrix display, and I think that was that's pretty cool because it shows it shows all these cool displays as you're playing, and you can see that on the top right. It is it is exactly what that what that board would show, and this one I <laughs> <Move>. <laughs> I <laughs> and I just keep dying. It's so easy. It's so easy to die. Ooh, I like that effect. Hey, there's there's one again. Oh yeah, and I have that little flipper on the top. I really like the sound effect on this one. Let's do it. I have a pretty good I have pretty good score, even though I died quite early on. <laughs> Surprised. Cannon loaded. Cannon loaded! More cannons! More cannons incoming! Oh, I thought that was a... I thought that was a cannon thing! What happened to the cannon? I like my cannons. Oh, man. <laughs> All three. Oh, no! Shoot again, though. Yes! Oh, that was pretty weak. Let's do it again! Come on. You can do it. I almost got that- I almost got that combo complete. I really want it. I want it. I've never wanted something this much in my life now. I've wanted, I've wanted a lot. Oh no! <laughs> Is that it? No, that's it for me. <laughs> Ooh, that's a high score though. Ooh, that's uh, the global high score is way higher. <laughs> I thought I was doing well. My best score was even higher before. <laughs> oh well. And yeah, there are also. Uh, there, yeah, there's just so much to cover. Uh, there's, uh, there's, uh, there's the tournament. I guess tournament. See, online player and the tournament seem like it's working. So that's what I was wondering. But um, I guess tournament kind of feels like uh, the tournament kind of feels like leaderboard in a way. But yeah, I guess this is where I'm gonna have to end, guys. I do believe that this game has been worked on very well by the developers. It's just that it just doesn't have too much exposure, and, and not too many people know about it. And that the fact that it's pinball, and not too many people, I guess, know about pinball um, when it comes to modern gaming. Uh, I just wanted to kind of do it justice by having a full gameplay of the game and kind of show you what what what's up, what's pinball, and. Uh, how cool pinball is, I guess. Um, I really do enjoy pinball when do I when I do have time. Uh, it is very casual and it's pretty relaxing. And it is also free to play, so do check it out. Uh, these are all free to plays. You guys can purchase some of the uh, some of the machines if you guys do like it. And I do, uh, yeah, recommend checking it out. It is it's definitely free. So as I said always before, uh, when I do when I did reviews before, uh, if it's free, why not? You know. If it's free, why not? It's always a it's always a plus when something is free. 
But anyways, as I said, this is where I'm going to end, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you guys haven't already or if it's your first time here. Really helps me out when you guys do that. And uh, yeah, with that, thank you so much once again for watching the video. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next video.